Laundromat in a 101 arcade machine. There you go. All right. Time for Kenny to show us some things. All right. And the first thing is asteroids. asteroids. Make fun of the box and he's glued. Start hey. blasting. That's the thing. Now, here's something it's that I've It's your only way out of this cloud of hurtling astral bodies. Peripheral vision, lightning reflexes, and cool control. That's what it takes to save your ship and your life. So, that's asteroids. fun. Asteroids. Uh, Go ahead and open it. One or two question. players, man. Wait, it opens this way or that no, way? No, don't. What happened? It's, it's it's unglued. It's an old game, Chris. It's I mean, unglued. If and you he's say already, so. He's already messing it up. First attempts are below 10K, bro. Oof. Now, what, are you, why, what are you opening it up? Oh, you yeah. Do this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, true. So, asteroids. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. <laughs> Especially when you have an, a, nin a Nintendo, right? You have, an, you have an NES. You have games like Bionic Commando. You have games like Castlevania Metroid. And then you have Galaga, Xevious, yeah. um, Pac-Man. Mm -hmm. Like, I just feel like there's something missing when you have, like, it's like, oh, I got a new game for my Nintendo. And it's mm -hmm. like, but it's, it's Burger Time. Or it's, like I said, Metroid or Super Mario 3. Like, it's the same size cartridge it's the same box it's the same everything mm -hmm. except one game is just the same thing over and over again and another one's like an adventure yeah right so wait, what's your point so i'm just saying like in general like it's so weird when you're like oh i got asteroids and it's like like what i did the first two seconds i played the game is what i'm gonna do forever but you know what i will say this i've come to realize that you feel like you get your money's worth basically if you if got asteroids over personally probably not but that's me now yeah, yeah. in my well, stupid yeah, yeah, yeah. 40s. But that's a, it, it's just back different in the styles day. Of games. Obviously, back in the it. day. But don't forget, this yeah. is why this is why we do this stuff too, and why we're on Player's Guide yeah. is because there's a there's a market for that, I right? Gotcha. I know, I know. So, it's just it's it's time. It's you know, well, Kenny, I, I tell me how much a large saucer, how many points that'll get I you. I thought you were gonna say sausage. Large sausage. I was like, there are no sausages. Large sausage in asteroids. There is. You just don't know. <laughs> uh, one hundred. Two hundred. How about a large asteroid? That was a sauce. It is an asteroid. Uh, 200. 20. 20 points? How about a small asteroid? Oh, probably 50. 100. Okay. Medium is 50. How about other player ships? Oh, that's right, because you can play two players in this. You can play two players. Um, other player ships, 500. Yeah! How about a small saucer? Last one. Last one, 1,000. Yeah! Oh, I got job. two of them. Good job. So back in the day, there was... What an, day? I had an Atari 7800. And another thing... You did have an Atari I'm going to talk... I had an Atari 7800, and I also had a TurboGrafx-16. You make fun of me for that stuff. I do. Right? But here's the thing. I mean... You know. Not only did I have uh, a 7800, yeah. but I also had an NES eventually. Eventually. Not only did I have the Turbo Graphics, I also had a Super NES. So I did have that, and I had more. Can't get See what I'm saying? Here. I yeah. had the experience of this and that. Whatever. Anyway, this was one of those it. games that always eluded me because what I never it? had it in stock at Toys R Us. But I used to see it in the Sears Wish Book. Cracked. It's yeah, well, about, yeah. It's a game about eggs. What is it? Crack? What? Crack did it? Go to Cracked. my camera. Go to my camera. Cracked. Okay. I don't know what you want to say about that. <laughs> Wait, let me look. See, but this is what the thing is. They didn't take a picture of the TV screen this time. It no. looks like it's a, right. it is. It is a well, picture of the TV looks screen. Like on this one. It is a picture yeah. of a TV screen. What is happening? I couldn't get it in. It's, I didn't want to break it. The box is already broken. This was 1987, Ken. Robert Neve or Nev. Yeah. Created this apparently. Yeah. Rooster Ranch, save those precious eggs. Hungry bandits from Blue Jays to slithering snakes are after your eggs of the rare South African hornbill. Blast those nasty creatures hornbill. as they swoop down to snatch the hornbill. So what was this? It was a shooting game. This yeah. was a uh, like an arm, like a shooter. Yeah. The Atari Advantage. Collect games, win prizes. All right. Details inside. Here, this one I'm gonna give uh, to Chris for the things. There, there was. What are you doing? These some, there. He's going front. There, so there were some happening. Lynx specialties. Um, Links oh that God. I've that I've seen recently. Horrible. So come on, man, look at it. Yeah, <laughs> Bill and Ted. Be most triumphant, dude. Now the cool thing about the links here, 
Besides the, the goofy little cartridge. Be excellent to each other. Was, Did you guys oh, see yeah. the third one? I watched the third one. Oh, that's the right. Sequel. Yeah, it was yeah, pretty right. good. I liked it. So I mean, that's the game. Some, yeah, these little Lynx things. And Looks here, like look. some of you you do it like a, <clears throat> put on for your phone screen. You'd be like, whoa, what's all this about? So it comes with I a like poster. This. I like this. All right. I like what's happening Not here. only is it a poster, however, it's also the it's instructions like, like, for the game. That's and it's sick. got some really awesome art of uh that's cool you know yeah. of of your your, your dudes your face. No one needs to see I know it. I know I know I'm trying to I'm just trying to square it up it. Yeah, I got you man back it so, up back it up it's fine How's that there good? You go. Yeah, there you go. You see man. that? It's pretty good man. Read, read a couple things. Pretty read good. This, read this yeah, one. read this one it says what six times 16 dude? Whoa, I don't know dude. Should have stayed awake in old man Stevens math class. Like, come that, that, on, come man. on. Like, that's, that's Bill and Ted's you know? stuff you've never the seen. The poster is better than the game. Yeah, that is true. Let me see what the game looks like. I didn't even see what the game looks like. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let's put this. Let's put this. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it gives it to me. That's <laughs> what I'm saying. It doesn't go in right. I hate <clears throat> this. Yeah. Be most triumphant, dude. Okay, put, the, put this up. Yeah, anyway. Okay. Right. Right. Um, next one Stun Runner. Stun Runner. Still on my camera. Next one Stun Runner. So there you go. Um, this game was cool. It really didn't come home. I think a couple computers and stuff like that. However, um, this was like an arcade staple, right? You ever played this in the arcade? Maybe. Put your skills against Earth Invaders in the 25th century. You'll need to know all the driving skills. You'll need all your driving mm. skills in the narrow, twisting underground tunnels of the subterranean network. It was like 3D-ish, right? It was like it was like a like vector. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Where'd so it, it was kind of like like I feel like this Stun was like a uh, the cr a cross between uh, hard driving, which I believe it used the same engine in the arcade, and uh, like um, no. <sighs> Tempest. Oh yeah. So again, see, look at that. This, this, if, I, if I made this game, it'd be called Stud Run. Oh, so wait, was I didn't realize that was that was it, so this was a this was a a, a Lynx thing. This was yeah. The posters. Yeah, oh, I didn't realize that. Pretty sweet, right? I didn't realize that. That's cool. All right. Yeah. I didn't know. Did I know that? I think this is the I first. This is the first Lynx game we have. No, in. we have. Uh, I'm sure we've seen them. Gauntlet. Gauntlet. Oh, the third did encounter. Did we see that one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So anyway, um, wait. Got to put the little game back. Yeah. All right. Put the game back in there. Um, and then you need. Everybody needs a copy of uh, Kung Fu. Oh God, please no. Kung Fu is the first Flash game. That's a that's a that's a Newgrounds Flash game. <laughs> I'm telling you. It's, oh look. It's a Newgrounds Flash game. Whoa! Okay. All right. Let's get the biggest. Oh, hold on a second. Oh man. Dosh Spiel. All right, hold on. There's a game there is are so. A lot of um. All right. So, after you pick up some points, they appear in the upper right corner of the screen. Your totals also blah blah blah. Points are scheduled as follows. Yeah, Kung Fu uh, is just. Bad. Okay. So, uh, Iceman. How many is he worth? One thousand. Three hundred. Damn it. Sausage Man. Yeah. Tom, there's a sausage man. We were just talking about sausages and asteroids. <laughs> sausage man, how much is he worth? 500. 200. Whoa! Tomato. 100? 400. What? P. I don't remember. Uh, uh, 100. You don't remember. I don't remember the yes, score you're, you're right. 100. You're right. You're right. Trying to gauge, you know? How about, how about Big Batter Man? <laughs> yeah, right. I don't know if they mean batter like he has a bat, or do they mean batter like... Cookie batter, or probably cake, like batter, cake, like cake, cake batter. Cake batter. Yeah. Hold on, there's a rat riding sausage and a big green slimy. I'm done. Um, sometimes you get a game for the cover. What is that one? This one's called Dirty Larry. Whoa, Renegade Cop. <laughs> so, the the I'm gonna tell you a couple things about Dirty Larry. First of all, it's a play on. Hold what, on, what year is that? Ninety two. What is it a play on? To come on, Chris. Come on, come on. What? Dirty Let's Harry. No, yeah, Dirty look Harry. At the, look at the, the first page. Dirty Larry, renegade cop. Have a nice day, punk. Like, it's like, shut up, bro. Dude, I get it, man. Dirty Harry. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. Oh, hold on. You control Dirty Larry, the toughest cop in Steelburg, as he walks the streets in search of the nefarious Mr. Big. Make my week. Yeah. I'm the one who wants to be with you. No? Don't do that. Are you going to fix that? Uh, yeah, sure. I didn't realize what was happening. Go to you. Let's people look at you, not me. There we go. Dirty Larry. 
<clears throat> so sometimes you buy games for the box. Oh my god. <laughs> for the cover art. <laughs> and there's one right there. It's called, what is it called? It's called Malibu Bikini Volleyball. I couldn't see the light was in my eyes. Yep. Malibu Bikini Volleyball. Just looks... That's it. Let's see what the inside looks like. Maybe we'll get to play that tonight. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> Maybe we'll play it tonight. You never yep, know. Yep, yep. Is, there, is there a game? Is Let there, me see. Sorry, is there a story? Nope. No story. Sorry. What does Dirty Butt Face look like? Coin toss. Anyway. They all look the same. They all like have because it's links. It had, it's they had links. no choice. But you know what? They did it. They did it, man. It was a handheld. They did it. So, so whatever. Okay. Sometimes you buy a game because the, you like the game, even though the game is not that good. But oh, it's got like the most rocking '80s ish. Well, it's not even the '80s. It's uh, something else. Oh man, what is it? Fatal. It's Fatal Fury, Fury for the Neo Geo. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dolph Lundgren. That's no, definitely Duff Lundgren. I don't even know what's going on on that cover. You better just shut up about it. That's Duff Lundgren. Go to your camera. It's fine, man. Go, go There you go. Bam! Shabam! Turn look it around. At, look at it. Oh, my Turn God. Turn it around. Let's show the back. Well, the, the back is, is like Fatal Fury, show, you but... Know, man? I just like Come this, on, man. Oh, man. Like this, you know. <sighs> fatal Fury. And I, th I think that's Terry. Terry is kind of getting it in the background there. Did you get all these this week? Yeah. He said, yeah. Yep. Oh, right. I remember that. Yeah, is it, you think that's Andy? Like I thought that was Andy, but I'm like, dude, right? I'm not. Just, I'm not so certain. Why? Why? Because Andy doesn't dress like that. Like, though they, they, they were they trying to? I don't know, man. Smell. Yeah, I gotta smell. Why do we always have to smell this thing? Like, look, that's in. That's Andy. Oh. We always. Here. I don't know why we smell this. Is that weird? Is it weird? Nah. Look, that's Andy. God damn. Um, You're going to end up getting a Neo Geo, aren't boy. you? I don't know, man. This is how many now? One, two, three? This is three. You know, we've all been fighting games. Yeah. Did you know that about yourself? So, I used to be on a bowling league. I was on a bowling the league. The only reason I was on a bowling league is because my friends needed somebody um, because they, they had somebody bail. So, I said, yeah. And you know why I said, yeah? Because the bar had... French fries that I used to love to eat with mustard. So I didn't care about playing bowling. I'd be like, dude, on every week I get to go to the bowling alley and eat French fries and play Super Sprint and play the Neo Geo that they had there. They had like so a, they had where's like a, Kenny? Kenny, what are you doing? Come on, we it's your turn. He they, rolls up, just yeah. throw, chucks the ball, goes back and plays. Anyway, they had I think I don't, I think it was a, a two slot Neo Geo. It might have been more, but I remember they had Magician Lord in it and they had. Freaking baseball stars. Baseball oh. stars for the Neo Geo was... Uh, sorry. The Nintendo version was good. Mm -hmm. All right? It was a good game. We baseball stars professional mm -hmm. was like another... It's like another thing. ahead of it. And what do you so got? I got that. Oh. So two Neo Geos today. Oh, man. Yeah. Baseball yeah, stars is good. fantastic. That's good. So... That's good. Yeah. We should play this, man. Freaking love baseball stuff. We should we should definitely play baseball stuff. So we should yeah. play this one. Yeah. It's a good game. Oh, look at this. It's still in the in the wrapping wrapper. Look at that. Right. Yeah. I didn't yeah. care about bowling. I cared about Oh, that's a little. Oh, yeah, that's a little it's a little bit, yeah. Freaking love it. Weird. We're Come so on, weird. man. Lynx games don't smell that good. Nothing smells that good. Even like the like Nintendo cartridges, they don't have a good smell. No, Neo Geo though. Pure just like... Anyway, that's the end of it. And then there's a Gremlins card in here. But that's nothing else to do with it. Yeah. Don't worry. Very about cool. That. So good All stuff, right? right? Yeah. You like it? I Hope like you that. like it. I like that. It's good. Um What do you think? Um is there something the next thing? We're doing the next thing? We're gonna go on. We're gonna move on. Hold what on. are we doing? What are we doing? Like a quiz or something? These guys are freaks. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Alright, there you go. There's your there there's your thing. If we did thumbnails, oh this could be a thumbnail. Do thumbnail. We haven't done thumbnails in a long time. 